I finally saw a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles this weekend, so I figured that, as a huge fan of the Turtles, I'd offer my thoughts on the film. There won't be any spoilers in this review. When I first saw the trailers earlier this year, I was expecting the worst. I hated what I saw and thought the movie would be horrible. So fast forward a few months later and I'm sitting on my ass in a the movie theater Saturday afternoon and I watched it and it was actually better than I was expecting it to be. I thought the movie really did the personalities of each turtle very well, though I just didn't like hearing Johnny Knoxville's voice coming out of Leonardo's mouth. I thought that it either wouldn't make a difference to me or it wouldn't bother me, but it did. It wasn't terrible, but it just didn't sound right. I think Jason Biggs does a better job on the current Nick show, and even then I don't like it. Probably the biggest casting surprise to me was Megan Fox's April O'Neil. Fox did actually way better than I was expecting her to. I still think somebody else would have done better, but credit where it's due, she wasn't terrible. I know, I'm surprised I'm saying that myself, but hey, she didn't do terrible. The turtle that shined the most in this film, I believe, was Michelangelo. Lots of good one-liners, and just overall, he brought out the most. Next is my personal favorite, Raphael. I thought that they were really trying hard to make Donatello a nerd. I mean, yeah, I guess you can say he is a nerd, but the movie tried too hard to make him seem overly nerdy. The thing I didn't like about the turtles, besides their designs, was how huge they were. They were too tall and too muscular. That, and they never seemed to use their weapons. The only times they really seemed to use their weapons were to fight Shredder and to escape from certain death. There also wasn't any karate fighting with the Foot Clan, so that was pretty disappointing. And they used assault rifles, which I didn't like at all. The Foot Clan are supposed to be ninjas, not members of a SWAT team. But if there's one thing I hated, like really hated about the movie, it's the origin story. I won't go into it, but let's just say that if you're a Turtles fan since the early 90s like I am, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. It sucked. It sucked hardcore. Oh, and the way Splinter taught the Turtles ninjutsu? So lame and a major cop-out. I felt this sense of camaraderie with the Turtles. The guys who played them did very well in making me believe that they were the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I felt like a kid again, which was an awesome feeling. My rating for the movie would be a 7 out of 10. They did more right than they did wrong. Some things were fucked up like I mentioned, but I enjoyed the movie and I'm looking forward to the sequels. Just please get a different voice actor for Leonardo.